Hello everyone, so um, this is a different video to all my others, uh, but again back in the old realms of the Peugeot. Now this is a bottom crank pulley. Now what will happen is this crank pulley sits, if you think of this being the engine side, uh, what will happen is you'll sometimes start hearing a clicking noise, uh, not too dissimilar to uh, tappets that needed adjusting on engines of uh, days gone by. Now what happened with mine is this is an internal part of this here there's a spring and all sorts of rubber rubbish um Peugeot in the wisdom for you know trying to reduce vibration that was coming through made this in such a way and this has now got a you probably can't see this but there's a, a definite well flex to that I, I can feel it so that's that's ruined now um when that goes it's here and I think you can see this quite well so this is a new uh, crank pulley that's an 18 mil bolt there and to undo it you just basically put uh, this into fifth gear and you can get an air gun on that and whiz it off. Alternatively if you're using manual tools you'll need to uh, put a locking pin into the engine to stop the crank from rotating. So you just undo that. Um, sorry apart from that you actually have to undo your drive belt which is a 16mm bolt up at the top. Uh, quite easily done with a spanner. So if I just show you quickly on how that can be achieved. So all you need to do is, as you can see down here, you've got, I think you can see just in there, and all you do is you pull down on it. You probably need to get some additional leverage, which you can achieve by putting a second ring spanner on. So this is a bit of a game like a plunk. So generally all you do is you pull that back, it releases the tension and as you can see I can essentially move that around with one hand. If I didn't have the camera I'd be able to just show you that fully. So essentially the removal and uh, replacing of the drive belt is as simple as that. Um, it's probably one of the easiest ones to the Peugeot engine that I've worked on for a long while so I'm quite pleased with that. So. If you again have that tapping noise uh, from here, you'll, you can hear it from this angle here. It sounds generally as if it, the noise uh, is audible up around this area. However, if you want to get a better understanding, what we'll do is take, take your wheel off and take the inner arch off like you have done here and you can get access. And if you hold your head roughly about here, you'll be able to hear tapping and generally that'll be something like this tapping away at the back of the engine. Um, if you don't replace this, what can happen is that pulley will fall to pieces, chuck things into the uh, the cover that holds, or retain some of the, yeah, sorry, it retains, got camera blank, bollocks. Um, yeah, I'll cut this part out. Yeah, it's, um, generally will get scooped up into the cam cover, get onto the cam belt and just ruin your engine. So if you start hearing it, it's best to replace it. Unfortunately, this part here in the UK, I've just paid £158. Not happy about it because I deem it as a design flaw of Peugeot making crap. Uh, but there you go, that's how it is. So hopefully you'll find this useful. By all means, you know, if you want to post to me, uh, I'll respond back on these. I do quite like the Peugeots. Um, some of my work colleagues think I'm nuts, but hey-ho. Okay, thank you very much.